introduce yourself to us and um, tell us why we're all here today. Hi, my name is Joan Perch and I am with Follow the Fish Art and Adventure Trails. We're here at the um, Black River Landing for the Lorraine International Festival and we are launching our new Follow the Fish Art and Adventure Trails um, campaign which is scheduled for the summer of 2013, that's next summer, where we hope all of these fish that are, that are around here will be lining our lakefront communities, um, pointing the way to businesses, attractions, fun events, um, festivals, and we hope that you'll be following the fish to all kinds of great times. The fish have been created by an outstanding North Ridgeville artist named Jim Gunlock, and they all move. So there's not too many public art projects that are made of moving sculptures, which is very, very cool. And they'll be painted, um, the largest of them will be painted by professional artists, but we have opportunities at all levels for communities to be involved, um, from installing a big fish sculpture like this or painting um, small ones. We've got a fish that will be created by school children in schools, and ultimately, when the project is over, we're hoping that it will be a fundraiser for uh, art programs in schools because we really think that the arts are important everywhere. They're important for our kids in learning. They're important for communities and fun. They drive business and they're a great tool for economic development and that artists are some of our created, creative, uh, most respected professionals and we want to give them opportunities to showcase their work too. So we hope you join us and follow the fish. <laughs> well, that's great. So be honest. Is your last name really Perch? My last name is really Perch. Um, I. I couldn't say no to this opportunity. It's got all of my passions in it. Um, children, art education, artists, arts and business, and then with a name like Perch, you just like have to have to sign on for Follow the Fish. And so what groups are actually behind this? At this point, um, we're just launching the project, but we've got a lot of great support. The Lorraine Port Authority is, of course, behind it. The Lorraine Growth Association, the City of Avon Lake, um, the Avon Schools, we have uh, the Lorraine County Visitors, Visit Lorraine County, the Lorraine County Visitors Bureau, which is really um, going to be instrumental in helping us market the program um, all through the summer and help us with that, which we're going to be doing through social media and games and all kinds of trails that are really designed to um, entice people to hop from place to place. Whether you're somebody that knows your way around but just needs to learn a little bit more and you're local, but we're also really looking for this to be something that builds on some of the uh, great work to showcase this wonderful region, our lake, our river, um, all the great things in Lorraine County. Okay. So this um, display we have here at Black River Landing, is this the first one? This is the first one. Um, it is our launch point today. So this mm -hmm. sculpture behind me will stay up through the summer and then the fish will come down and they'll come back again next summer and then we've got examples of some of the other fish that um, will be either painted by artists or in front of some storefronts. Uh, there's a whole variety of sponsorship um, packets that we're developing and ways for artists and businesses and communities to get involved. So we're going to connect all of those pieces in the next month and we hope that people stay posted and are interested. They can contact us right now. Um, we're on Facebook so you can follow the Fish Art and Adventure Trails there. Uh, we've, I'm sure you'll provide some contact information and soon we'll be getting our website going. We'll have a fundraiser in September and that's when all of the real the sponsorship packets and so forth will really be hitting, hitting the road, flying with the fish. <laughs> that's great. So where else specifically do you know that you're going to put some of these displays? These specific sites will be matched with the sponsors. So um, it's really all about the community making the decisions with us about where these will go. It's about community and partnership and collaboration, not us coming in with these and kind of dictating where they go. Mm -hmm. um, we'll be a team uh, that helps to use the art and the arts to drive business in the way that the businesses and the communities really see a need for it. We're also hoping that some other fun things develop. Um, we've had a lot of fun with our little fish face thing over there that um, <laughs> kids have been coming in and so the idea that we could create parades or special events is also um, something that we're looking into but our first most important thing is getting more sponsors, getting more people from the communities involved, getting the schools involved and really kind of moving forward. Mm -hmm. So so fish are obviously a very big symbolic thing in this project. W what exactly does that represent? For us, um, the fish move. Um, there's a real identity to the fish that we've chosen. There's a perch, um, bluegill, 
and I'm forgetting the third one. But we've got a couple of different fish species. A walleye! How could I forget the walleye? Uh, <laughs> um, and then the whole idea is that about sustainability. This is um, these are we have things here in Lorain County uh, that we should be treasuring and valuing. Our natural assets, the parks, the beaches, the lake, the river, um, the wildlife. They're all important treasures, and so Ladies we're really and looking to uh, highlight sustainable Related issues, make the things out of sustainable materials, incorporate that message into everything that we're doing here. Very good. And any last words to anyone who either wants to see these displays or be a sponsor or be a part of this in any way? You can find us. You can find us at Follow the Fish, um, and I'm... You can call us. I'm sure the contact page, the you know, information will be with us. So just uh, look up Follow the Fish. We are um, affiliated with the Port Authority, with Lorraine Growth Association, so there are all kinds of ways to follow us. Uh, and soon we'll be getting our website up and running. So uh, just find us. We're here. Okay. Well, thank you very much. Thank you.